Hi ladies, so just a real quick update, because I feel like, I don't know, I have a, I have a little bit of information, but since April 12th there's like this big gap in space, you know, a big space and time where I haven't really said anything, but there's not, not really much to report, but anyway, um, just for the Anywho, for the sake of it, let's just go ahead. Um, today is um, 11 DPO, um, but it's cycle day 24, and that's kind of strange to me, because usually I have a cycle. So, 11 DPO on cycle day 24, and I don't remember my last Clomid cycle. Um, I don't know how, I guess I should have looked that up on Fertility Friend, um, but, so, I guess, between tomorrow and Saturday, I should be able to test, or get my period, I don't know, um, usually, without medication, my cycles are 28 to 31 days, so I'm kind of at a stalemate at this moment because I don't feel any symptoms either way um, and I don't remember how long my I need to look that up maybe I'll put it in the description box um, I don't remember my luteal phase length on clomid that's really bugging me um, anyway like I said this is a clomid cycle and um, Yesterday, I went to have my second luteal phase um, progesterone level done. Um, he'll probably call me um, later today. It's like 2 in the morning now, but he'll either call me later today or a Thursday probably to tell me because he usually calls me and tells me, oh, your period's going to start, um, because your progesterone's dropping, but, um, so, the plan from here on out is, I guess, <laughs> uh, wait to start because I'm, I'm not one for wasting tests. It's really freaking me out that i um, not having any cramps or any twinging or nothing's wrong, no, no boob. I don't know. Nothing's... No irritability, no nausea. I, I'm not feeling pregnant or unpregnant. It's just nothing. So, if AF comes, I go for an ultrasound on the 30th of April. Other than that, we're at a stalemate. We're done. Talk to you later.